Okay, up to this point, we should all know what SpongeBob SquarePants is. It's the most popular Nickelodeon show that started airing in 1999. Anyways, I was an animator down at Nickelodeon Studios. I was about to go get my one more coffee mug, but then I saw something next to it. There was a DVD box. The cover had Patrick Star walking to SpongeBob's house. On the top of the cover was the SpongeBob SquarePants title and at the bottom of the over said, The Best of Patrick. I was wondering to myself, what's this doing here? Anyways, after my work was done, I took it home, because hey, it's a free SpongeBob DVD I just got. After I got home from work, I took the DVD from the box and placed it inside the DVD player. After a few commercials and whatnot, I finally got to the DVD menu. The background had Patrick sitting on his chair under his rock. On top of the screen was the usual SpongeBob title and next to it were words saying, The best of Patrick. The selections were Play, scene selection, bonus episodes, and extras. I pressed scene selection and it took me to the selections. In the background was Patrick and SpongeBob jellyfishing together. The episodes in the selection were 1. Naughty Nautical Neighbors 2. Valentine's Day 3. Big Pink Loser 4. Dumped 5. The Secret Box 6. I with Stupid 7. The Fry Cook Games 8. Chocolate with Nuts 9. New Student Starfish. You know, the good stuff. However, the 10th episode was something I never saw before. It was called, Oh Patrick. I was confused of what this episode was, so I pressed on that. This is when things start getting weird. After the pirate painting said the usual, Are you ready kids? The kids then started laughing hysterically and grew more demonic for every second. Also, the screen was fading to black. After it completely went black, red text appeared on the screen in the usual SpongeBob font. It said SpongeBob SquarePants, and under that were smaller words saying, by Steven Hillenburg. After that unsettling intro, the title card appeared, saying Oh Patrick. With Squidward in the background on fire. The episode started with Gary watching TV in SpongeBob's living room. This lasted for 8 seconds until it cut to black. After two seconds, it then showed Gary's shell destroyed with no sight of Gary. A shadow of Patrick appears, saying, He will be, what he's meant to be. The shadow Patrick's voice sounded demonic, which started to creep me out. The episode then cut to SpongeBob's kitchen with SpongeBob eating Kelpo cereal. After he ate his cereal, he then said, Well then, I need to take a wash. And laughs. He went to his bathroom, and when he was about to go inside the shower, he saw the Shadow Patrick, saying, He isn't what you think he is anymore. SpongeBob then screamed and ran away. When he went to the living room, he then bumped into Patrick. You think Patrick would have his usual voice as he has in other episodes, but no. I realized, after he said, Hey SpongeBob, wanna go jellyfishing? His voice was a bit distorted. The screen then cut to black again, for about 5 seconds. After that, I couldn't believe my eyes. It showed Patrick beating up Sandy Cheeks. Sandy's stomach was cut open, with her organs under her. Creepy music also started playing, and Patrick. Well, Patrick was the same as before, but with realistic eyes and gray pupils. The scene was too unsettling for me, so I vomited in a trash holder. The Shadow Patrick slowly became visible, who was right next to Patrick. After he was completely visible, he then said, still with the demonic voice. Yes. Yes. Keep doing it. This is your destiny. <laughs> After that horrifying experience, it then cut to black for another five seconds. It then showed Patrick walking to the Krusty Krab. Patrick went up to Squidward, still with the distorted voice, saying, Hey Squidward, how about doing a minor scale, huh? Squidward then said, I'm busy, Patrick. I don't have time for your tomfoolery. Leave me alone. The Shadow Patrick slowly became visible again and said, Turns out this one here needs to be taught some manners. While pointing at Squidward. He then ran up to Squidward, with Squidward screaming. There was then static for four seconds, until I saw Squidward lying there on the floor. He then opened his eyes, revealing pitch black eyes. It then cut to black once again. 
I was really getting terrified at this moment, but then I saw something that gave me a real reason to get terrified. It was a realistic Patrick with bloodshot eyes. Blood was dripping from his mouth and he was in front of Sandy's corpse. To the left of him was Gary's broken shell and to the right was possessed Squidward. There was also static playing. The possessed Squidward, still with the demonic voice, then said. Oh Patrick, you finally did it. You fulfilled your destiny. After that, the TV cut to static for 8 seconds. And after that, the credits were shown, but it wasn't the usual credits. The text was literally just plain red text with a black background. After the United Plankton logo, it then showed the Nickelodeon logo, and it was in the shape of Patrick. After that, I immediately ejected the DVD. I went to Nickelodeon Studios, telling the other employees about the experience of the DVD I had. After that, all the employees just ran away. Weird. Did they have the same experience with this disc? We may never know.